Okay, um, for the intermediate level course we come to a drill that's, that's known as intentional immersion. And it's unpleasant, um, but it's got to break the psychological barrier we may have about getting inadvertently completely soaked. Um, and then dealing with the aftermath of that. Not relying on just jumping out and changing our clothing. So basically the students after they do this have to function until tomorrow morning and deal with their personal administration, uh, their equipment, their clothing, get through the night uh, and still be there in the morning. So obviously I shouldn't have to say this needs to be done under supervision with the right level of student, but it does. So we'll give it a go now and you guys can see uh, how it looks. First one. Very dark, scary music. Open up. See, that's how it's feeling. <laughs> Be careful the nose, it's going to help you deal with the cold. Obviously with this creek water I really don't want the guys getting this in their mouths. Which is why instead of making them roll around I'm using the bucket just to uh, ensure we can see where the water's going. Also the temptation is to dip so quickly you actually don't get fully soaked. Whereas you can see here that's not happening. <laughs> okay, Dad, I'm not going to hit your chest. I'm just going to go legs down. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, well done. To deprive me of the privilege? Yeah, Miss Alvin. Oh, you know, I thought about it. I thought about doing it for everybody. Everybody else should enjoy it too. You just let Well done. Joy That's one. Mm. All right, let's go, big fella. You're all very complicit like that, just like head straight in, you know? Yeah. No messing. Ready? Okay. 
Okay, so some great points there. You saw the key thing for these guys to do was get control of their breathing because that made the situation a lot worse if they were taking mad sort of gulps. So once they kind of got that, focused through, did a brilliant job and uh, we'll go watch them do their drying routines. <laughs> 